I didn't hear to break the news that your son was caught up in the terrible car accident. I'm full. Oh. Uh, officer, I'm sorry to hear that. Please come inside. Let's talk. <laughs> that work? Oh! <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy Mighty, or you call me Trey, and welcome to Suck Up. I know that's that's a crazy name for a game so in this game we're playing as a vampire we basically got to go around our neighborhood and we got to get people to invite us into their house so we can suck up their blood because we're vampires blah 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 i do not say blah 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 not only that but uh well actually it uses ai and it uses our mic so i gotta go around and actually talk to these suckers and like <laughs> and like get them to put me in their house bro first house right here Yo, what's poppin'? <laughs> Yo, what's poppin', my dude? Not gonna lie, that paper bag on your face got me spooked. But what's your need? Uh, man, uh, my dog died and I don't got nowhere to go. Can you help me? If I hook you up with a spot to crash for the night, stay strong, my dude. Bruh, please, man, please. <laughs> I need help. I need help bad. Really? Uh, bruh, all right. <laughs> Yo, what's up? You here to fix the beat in my crib or what? Yeah, I heard there was a beat problem in here. Uh, you need any help with that? Have you had a gun? Oh, where? Yeah, I've been trying to lay down some fire tracks, but the sound quiet ain't it. You think you can handle that? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I'm a good producer, and I, you know, I do beats and stuff like that. So I can, I can definitely help you with that if you want me to. Wow! It sound legit. I'm down to collab. You got the skills. Show me what you got, fam. Thank you, thank you. All right, bet. Let's go. <laughs> Come on in, let's see if you can cook some on fire. Oh yeah. I'm gonna cook some on fire, all right? Ah! Uh ah! -huh. Uh -huh. Come here! Come here! Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> oh, I got him! I got him! Ah, oh, you freaking bum, I got you. Uh, yes sir, we got our styles on. All right, let's get them, let's get them. Y'all ready? Let's go. Oh, God, it's an older hey, woman. Well, hello there, dearie. What brings you to my doorstep at this hour? Hi, I need to use my phone because my freaking house is on fire. And, you know, my phone is, uh, it's kind of broke. Can I use yours? I don't know what I said. I'm <laughs> uh, dear, I'm sorry to hear about this situation, but I can't let you use my phone. It's not just something I'm comfortable with. Would you find some help soon? Wait. Oh, when the door stands on slut, the neighborhood watches out. All right, one more. Wait, one more time, one more time, one more time. I'm we'll trying one more again. <laughs> oh, honey, I completely understand your position, but I'm afraid that I can't let you use the phone. I made a promise to myself a long time ago to never let. Stop! Slamming the freaking door, bro. Oh, God. Freaky, freaky cop. Oh, God, we gotta go, we gotta go. I got this, I got this. Watch this, watch this. I'm gonna cook, I'm gonna cook. Hey there, man, what's happening? Hi, would you like to buy some of my Girl Scout cookies? I don't know. Uh, sorry, dude. I think you might be lost. This is more of a herb garden kind of place, if you know what I mean. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, I, I had a little problem just now, but uh, yeah, I like I like your flowers and everything. Uh, can you t like show me around and show me them, please? Oh, yeah, yes. Haha. No problem, man. I love showing my garden. Come on in. I give you a grand tour. Just keep it cool, all right? I got you. I got you. Ooh. Uh, my favorite flower is it's a roses. So I, I hope you have some of those. I want to see. Oh, dude, you're in luck. I got some killer roses in the backyard. Follow me, I'll show you. Yes, sir. All right, let's go. Awesome, man. Just remember to keep it on a down low if you catch my drift. These roses are right over here. I got you. Right on, my friend. So what brings you to the land of the herb and flowers today? Uh, I thought you were going to show me your flowers. Do you have any in your house that you'd like to show me? Uh, since you've been pretty chill so far, I can show you a little something inside. But remember, that's a peek, okay? Ah! Ah, come here! Come here! Come here! Yeah! Bro, who came up with this game, bro? 
They're a legend for this, bro. This game is fire. Look at him just standing there. All right, let's talk about golfing. All right, all right, we're going we to we go, we go golf. Let's go. Hello, I'm from. What in the dang place are you doing? Knocking on my door at another hour. <laughs> Why sell it? What do you want, son? Hi, I see that you play golf and you have some golf clubs in the back. And I would like to just see if you'd like to, you know, show me how to play or something. Oh, no. Are you out to go, dang mine? I ain't got time to be teaching some young whippersnapper like you to how to play golf. Now scram. Wait. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Wait, my outfit. Wait. All right, bro. You're the next victim. You're the next victim. We got it. We're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. Let's go. <gasps> he got golf clubs on his back. Well, well, what are you... <laughs> what we got here? This ain't no putt-putt place, so state your business or scram. Hey, I just see that you're... Like, you know, you got your uh, golf clubs and stuff on your back. And, you know, I just want to see if I can join you in a, in a couple of games. You think you can just walk in here, huh? You want to join our game? Well, maybe if you prove your worth of time, we can talk. Show you what you got, golfer. Hey, I can show you. Uh, can I come inside real quick, though? I'm kind of thirsty. Um, I've been walking around trying to find other people to play with, but, you know, nobody likes me. Hmm. Well, bad, bad, too. <laughs> Looks like you're not completely used to you come in, but only for a drink. Don't get an idea, golfer. I got my eye on you. All right. Thank you. Thank you, sir. <laughs> ah! Ah! Come here! Yeah! 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 <laughs> ah! We got him! Ah! <laughs> we got him! Ah! We got him! Put the hat on! Put the hat on! Next victim! Let's go! Come on! Give me something useful! Excuse me! What on earth are you, sir? <laughs> this ungodly hour! <sighs> you better have a good reason for disturbing my beautiful beauty sleep. I'm sorry, man, but I'm just here to admire your absolute beauty of, of a person you are. Like, you're so beautiful, and I just want to come over here and say that. Ah, oh, say wow. My personal safety is your flattery. I would not be tired. So I said, please, 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 I call the police. My bad. Ah! Wait, wait, wait. I need something different. I need something different. I need a different outfit. Wow. Well, well, play. well. What do we have here? Another fashion mishap in my neighborhood? I hope you're not here to ask for fashion advice because, honey, you need more than just a pink berry to fix that outfit. Yeah, ma'am. Uh, I, I, I've been having problems with my, with my closet and my wardrobe. And, you know, they say you're the best in the neighborhood, so I came to you. <laughs> oh, honey, I'm the best, but I'm afraid your problems are beyond my expertise. I wouldn't even know where to begin with that fashion catastrophe you're wearing. Good luck fixing your wardrobe, darling. No! Ah! Freaking bum! Come on, no, I'm. Ah! Oh! Ah! Hmm. Axe. Oh, she's going hiking. Okay, bet. Got it. Well, howdy there. Ain't she looking mighty fancy? You're a blue polo and a pink berry. What you got there in your hand? Some kind of fancy gadget? I reckon this ain't the time for a, sh a shingding. <laughs> so what brings you to my humble abode at this ungodly hour? Hi, ma'am. I just wanted to, uh, you know, um, thank you. Maybe you think a little of me, but I appreciate the kind words. So what exactly are you thanking me for? For your great work in the wilderness. I, I see that you got, got your axe there and, you know, you're, you're doing a, a wonderful job with that. Wow. Why, thank you, Colin. <laughs> Ain't nothing like swinging that axe and chopping wood to remind you of the simple pressure in life. It's hard. It's hard work, but it keeps me warm in the middle, in the winter. And give me strong muscles like a grizzly bear. So what you bring you here today? I'd like to talk to you about a problem in the wilderness and um, you know, in the woods and stuff. And uh, I, I thought you could help me with that. I need to get my words right. Thank you. I so I reckon I might just be the right person to lend a friendly hand. Come on in. Let's go. Yeah, you're dead. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. <laughs> come here. Come here. Come here. I got you. Alright, but this is for later at all. I'm a hero, 
Oh, get out of my ear, lady. Oh, well, well, well. Is she a doctor? What brings she? What brings a suspicious scavenger like you knocking at my door in the dead of night? Speak up. I haven't got all day. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I, I hurt my toe. And, and somebody somebody ran it over with a motorcycle, and I heard that you're a doctor. Please help me. Hmm. Mm. A hurt toe, huh? <laughs> well, I suppose I can take a look at it, but don't think you can fool me with your soft story. Step inside, but keep your hands where I can see them. Thank you. Thank you. Don't get too cozy, <laughs> suspicious scavenger. I haven't agreed to treat you just yet. Let's just see what kind of mess you got yourself into. Show me that toe. All right. Mm, hmm. Looks like quite a mess you made here. How did you manage to get your toe ran over by a motorcycle? Don't think I'm buying the story just yet. Freak. Uh, uh, uh. Basically, I was out with my brother and I, we was like dragging and, you know, like, like doing willies and stuff and he, he, he crashed and it hit my toe. Mm -hmm. Dragging willies crashing, huh? Your story keep getting more interesting. I'm not easy fool. Let me scan the injury toe of your toe. Just make sure there's no funny business going on. All right, ma'am, you can go ahead. Please, I need help. It, it really hurts. I think it's spreading up to my knee. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. I don't want them. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to that old lady and tell her that she need her prescriptions. Die. I was surprised to see a young scientist at my doorstep. At this hour, how can I assist you? Ma'am, I'm not a scientist, I'm a doctor. I'm here with your diagnosis from your uh, doctor visit the other day. Uh. Oh my, well, thank you for bringing the diagnosis, but I don't know if you call vision and doctor Lucy. No! Oh! <laughs> Sir, um, I'm here to tell you that your mother has been in a terrible car accident and we need you at the hospital right now. Well, why didn't you say so? I got no time to waste then. Let's get going to the hospital. Lead the way. And you, don't you dare drive too slow. Yes, sir. But can, I, can we come in and uh, can we talk about some documents, some papers that we need you to sign before we go there? In the head, the head. Freak! I sold it. Oh, God. I'm going to go on these seconds. I see flowers right here. It's a lady. Where's the mirror? I don't know. Oh, it's a lady. Well, 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 looks like officer, officer fastly late has finally arrived. What's the hurry, officer? Did you hear there was free donuts at the station? Ma'am, I'm not here for your corny jokes, but I'm here to break the news that your son was caught up in the terrible car accident. I'm on oh, oh. Uh, officer, I'm sorry to hear that. Please come inside. Let's talk. <laughs> Did that work? She said, let's she said, come on. She said, come on. I can't even talk. She said, come inside. Let's talk. And then she slammed the door in my face. <laughs> Ooh, I'ma kill you. And I love well, well, well. Look who it is. <laughs> Why? Why is she roasting me? <laughs> can't believe you're still trying to convince kids that sugary breakfast is the way to go. Nice beanie, by the way. Really brings out the crazy in your eyes. Who let you out of the cereal box? Hi, I just moved into the neighborhood and, you know, I just wanted to come by and, like, greet all my new neighbors and whatever. I know it's late, but, you know, it, it's, you know, best to start early. I need to get my words. I'm stumbling over my words. I'm right. Oh, look at you, mister. I just moved in. Let me tell you something. Moving into a neighborhood doesn't give you a free pass to serve everybody beautifully. <laughs> Maybe next time, try introducing yourself at a decent hour. Oh, my bad. Sorry. Uh... My clothes! Sorry, I was just trying to tell you that I just graduated from my college and you know, I, I'm here to party, man. Party! Party! <laughs> now we're talking. Congratulations on your college graduation, my dude. That's a huge accomplishment. You're definitely in the right place for an epic party. Let's make some memories. Yes, sir! Hey, I got the drinks too and I got the food, so you know, we already stacked. Let's go! Hey, 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. You got the drinks and the food? You're officially my new best friend. Party mode activated. Come on in, my fellow graduate. <laughs> Let's turn up the volume. Yes, sir. Uh huh. Yeah, let's turn it up for sure. Uh -huh. Yeah, we're gonna turn it up all right. We're gonna turn it up all right. <laughs> yep, got him. <laughs> all right, y'all. I'm gonna leave it right here because I gotta go do something real quick. But if you guys like to see a part two of this game, you guys already know what to do. Hit the like down below and please, please, please subscribe if you guys haven't yet. But I'll see you guys in the next one. So stay safe, stay mighty. Peace.